It is a force that keeps even the most foolhardy of us bouncing back to Earth. A force that builds planetary systems, giving life to our universe, but it is also the destroyer of stars. This force is gravity, an attraction that acts upon all of us, every moment of our entire lives. Our understanding of gravity begins in 1905 with the publication of Einstein's Special Relativity, a paper which changed physics and the world's views on space, time, mass and energy would never be the same again. This paper stated that space and time are meshed into a single entity, an entity known as space-time. In 1915, Einstein presented his theory of general relativity, where mass, energy and space-time are combined into a geometrical structure that describes gravity. Einstein's visionary decision to alter the Newtonian gravitational model provided a glimpse into the true nature of the universe. However, even Einstein himself realised that general relativity was an incomplete theory, and the search for a unified theory had begun. Over the past 100 years, no such theory has been found. In Stephen Hawking's best-selling book, A Brief History of Time, he states, Einstein spent most of his later years unsuccessfully searching for a unified theory, but the time was not right. There were partial theories for gravity and the electromagnetic force, but very little was known about the nuclear forces. Moreover, Einstein refused to believe in the reality of quantum mechanics, despite the important role he had played in its development. The time compression theory presents an argument that the incompleteness of general relativity led science down the wrong path. This has led physicists searching for a non-existent connection between the very large and the very small. Einstein's logic as a whole is certainly correct, resulting in the predictions of black holes, gravitational lensing, and the expansion of the universe, but it is incompatible with quantum field theory. With a small tweak to Einstein's model, the time compression theory offers an alternative approach to the concept of space-time. This new structure clears the uncertainties in the current model and presents a possible causality between what is known as the gravitational force and electromagnetism establishing the first possible unified theory. Future studies delve into the realms of black holes, quantum mechanics, spiral galaxies, and even the possibility of creating a time drive.